Wow. Isn't he so fluffy? <laughs> oh, he's so soft. You're such a strong guy. <laughs> What's, What's up, up family? <laughs> Welcome back to our crazy family. We're coming to you Peace with another you. episode. We're coming to you with another episode. It's been a long time. I'm so sorry, you guys. We have just been so busy and slammed with everything. But I promise yeah. we will do better. We say this every yeah. time, but I'm going to keep my word this time, all right? Let me fix this. Let me fix this. I'm not tickling you. Okay. All right, Rod, do you want to tell them what was supposed to be your surprise today? Well, Deuce is brother. Oh, boy. Yeah, but it's supposed to be a surprise, but it's my surprise now. You just always, you're just too smart. She figures out every surprise we have for her. But today we're getting another French Bulldog. We're getting Deuce's brother. And? We do not have a, well, Ryder has a name for him. It was actually going to be Deuce's name. You want to no. tell him? Danger. Danger. Ooh, I don't know how I feel about danger, guys. Ah. I don't know. If you guys do know, back in the day, Shy wanted to name our son Danger. But we would have been at the park screaming out danger and everybody would have been looking around confused. So I think we're going to steer away from that one. Um, like danger, like, like, let's call him like, like, there's the whole like danger, danger. Stranger danger. Well, today is just going to be oh, me and Ryder for right now. You get to look at my beautiful face. Yes, yes, yes. Shy is doing some work, paying some bills. She will be back. But it's been a... Uh, <laughs> it's been a good start of the morning. Um, I did Ryder's hair this morning. You guys want to tell me how I did? Come on, let's get a little pose. Side view, Ryder. To the side, to the back. Yeah. Let me know. Scale from 1 to 10 how I did. And if you guys think I should do Ryder's hair more often. Well, we good. always hold it. Huh? We always hold it. <laughs> well, we are getting another dog again. They are well, flying you in from North Dallas. Her name is Macy. Um... She comes from Diamond in the Fluff Frenchies. I love the names. It's a pretty unique one. I haven't heard of anything like it. But this one is a little slightly different from Deuce. He's a fluffy breed. I don't know if you guys know what that is, but you can Google it. But a fluffy French Bulldog. I don't know how they made it happen, what genetic they crossed with it. But they did it, and I don't know. I, I just love dogs. I grew up with dogs my whole life, so how do you feel about dogs, Ryan? Dogs or cats? Dogs. Or birds? I had each one of those. I used to have well, birds that would fly up on your shoulder and then sing and say, pretty bird, pretty bird. We should, at all house, we should get all cats. No. No, at all house, at our new house, we should get dog, cat, parrot, bird. Oh, I know, I, I like parrots. Those are pretty cool, but they just poop everywhere, right? I don't know how you would do with that. Well, you, you didn't do too well with your chickens. You were supposed to go clean the coop. <laughs> Ryder has been asking me, I feel like when I was a kid, I used to be in the car and be like, are we there yet? Are we there yet? Are we there yet? And that's what it's been all morning, but I'm happy she's excited to meet the new dog. Um, I hope he's not as crazy as Deuce. Deuce kind of has a couple screws loose. He's a little wild boy. Um, Deuce! Hey! What you got to say? You about to have a brother, or well, step brother. Where's the dog gonna sleep, Rod? In my bed. In your bed? Uh huh. I heard mommy say, "Not with me, not with me." You look like a seventy-year-old, blue-eyed. I don't know what. No, like his eyes mm -hmm. are gray, and then the they're blue. They're no. like blue, and then when you get in the sun, they're like... No, uh -huh. like, no, so like the inside, it's like blue, like a gray, bluish, mm -hmm. and then on the outside, it's like a sunshine yellow. A sunshine yellow? It's what do you like, think, what do you think Grandma's gonna think about the new dog when we bring him over with Deuce? <laughs> I don't know about Zion, the new dog. But about who? I know. That dog we're gonna get uh -huh. born a baby. Yeah, right? you think Ace is gonna like the new dog? Yeah. Okay. I, yeah, I, I'm just gonna be like, okay, three dogs, come, come, come. All right, well, we're gonna sit here. We're gonna have a little lunch. We're waiting on them to come. They um, got a hotel in Santa Monica. 
Uh, they flew in from North Dallas. I'm very, very appreciative of them doing this. Uh, I'm excited. I, like I said, I'm a dog person. Like, hmm, 30 more minutes. 28 more minutes. How about that? Is that long or short? 28 minutes isn't that bad. It's like an episode of two episodes of Coco Melon. I tried it. I don't think she's buying it, guys. Do you want to go watch it? After you watch two episodes, he'll be here. <laughs> okay. Are you sure? You didn't buy it. I am positive. Well, not 100% positive. I can't say that. I don't know. I'm not sure, right? I'm going to go put a camera on. Look at how big he is. Oh, my God. When did you get this big, son? Ace is sleeping. I just got him down after a long, long, long battle. So, hopefully he's this up is... by the time they get here. Ryder has a four and a half hour timer on. Oh my god. Do you know how long that is, right? You only need the two and the six. 26 minutes, okay? That, that, that's until it all that's comes? That's four hours. That's a long time. Okay, but let's let the little one sleep. He's in the wild. We're gonna wake him up later, okay? A few moments later. All right, guys. So, just got a text. I think the dog is about five minutes away. Ace, you don't even know what's about to happen, boy. Yeah, so five more minutes. We get to see the dog, guys. Ryder has set multiple timers on her iPad. She set one for 30 minutes, five minutes. What are you on your second five minutes, Ry? Your second five minutes? On your timer. Who's at the door? Who's here? Wait, hold on, Rod. We're gonna walk them around back, okay? Okay. Okay, but I want you to go through the back. I don't want you to see it until we get in the backyard, okay? We're still gonna have some type of surprise at them. Uh-uh, get to the back. Get to the back, get to the back. Oh, oh. oh my God. Oh no, he's so ugly. <laughs> Look, this. Look, this. Look up. <laughs> Him tonight, this boy. Wow. You hope that she's just, seeing seconds past. Just, just feel how soft he is. <laughs> dude. Zach's too excited. I Look. feel like this is just, it's working. Isn't he soft? Oh my god. Look at Deucey. Deuce. Oh Look, are you freaking out? Look, this is what I'm going to do. Come on. Look oh, at the doggy. Look at the doggy. You love him? <laughs> Deuce. Oh my goodness. Look at the baby. Be gentle. Oh, what are we doing? <laughs> Whoa. Oh, we're doing it. It's cute. Stink, do you see him? Wow. You want to see him? Ryan, guys? look. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look how fluffy he is. Oh. Careful. Careful. You see a doggy? He's a baby. Gotta hold his butt. Okay. Isn't he so fluffy? <laughs> Look at Deuce. <laughs> what are you gonna name oh, him? Yeah. Yeah. We're arguing oh, over the name. <laughs> yeah, I want Danger. She wants to name him Danger. I don't know if we can do that one. I want to name him Bank. Oh. Yeah. Bank and Deuce. Mm. Look that, at Ace looking. Is that what it's gonna be, Bank? Ready? We can't name him Bank. Whoa. You don't like bank, Ron? She doesn't. Down, dude. I like bank, too. You like bank, too? Mm -hmm. So what do you want to do, Ryan? What do you want to name him? I don't know. You want to decide a little later? Yes, no. You want to put names in a hat? No. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good idea. No, I don't. We all get an opportunity. Yeah, you can put him on. What name do you want? I'm rolling with bank. I think bank. Come on. Juice, Bank, Ryder, Ace. Come on, we got a whole squad. Hi. Right. Hi. Damn. I want to see. Here's the dog. Let me. Oh, okay, perfect. And then your mom and dad. Yeah, I couldn't. And then I got y'all something. Oh, shit. Juice. <laughs> what you doing, man? You got this. You don't know. Oh, he's so soft. He's soft as hell. You're such a shunk guy. 
How did he do on the plane? He was the small. angel. Like, and everyone that saw him, they were like, oh my God, what is that? I'm like, like so scared. <laughs> can, you ma- look, can you make one that stays this small? I know. <laughs> <laughs> I am your mother. <laughs> yeah, probably. Knowing my luck these days. Stop. Hi. Mommy. Mommy. You like it, Miss Trace? Let your brother see you. <laughs> oh, he's got his feeling turn. He says it's his turn. Uh, oh, oh, that's so cute. Give him a kiss, Ace. Look at the smush. Give him a kiss. <laughs> so, is it Uno induced or bank induced or danger induced? This is a gift. This is a gift that. Yeti Bill and I came up together for you guys. Yeti Bill? Yep, Yeti Bill. So you'll see what Yeti Bill's all about once you open it, but it's a really Shit. cute gift. Ready? Yeah. Mm-hmm. What are, you- are you sure? No! Uh, <laughs> I remember you telling me about this. Yeah. Wow. So he custom made that real Louis Vuitton collar for your puppy. Can it's, can a it's a collar. It's a collar, baby. <gasps> oh my god. We gotta get this one now. No, we gotta get me like a matching bag. <laughs> <laughs> a matching bag. I gotta get mommy. it inside. Inside. Okay. Oh wait, no, that lighting's better. Put it right there. Yeah, right. my mom actually helped mommy, like painted mommy. the box and stuff. This so. is dope. This is dope. Now we gotta get this one. I have to. It makes. Like... Damn. Sorry, oh. home. Wow. Ace, what do you think? Should we name the dog Bank or should we name the dog Danger? Deuce? What do you think? Should we name the new, uh, uh, excuse me, excuse me, we're talking. Deuce, we're talking. Should we name him Bank or Danger? Nope. What do you think? This is like, if you don't just let me outside, lady. Alright, alright. And we got a runner. Look at the barrier that Zach has built so that the new dog can't get out. One day with the new puppy, Righty. What do you think we should name him? Oh, Bank it. or danger? Oh, danger. Righty oh, no. says danger. I say bank. Oh, what are you saying, Ace? No, no, no. Come on, I'll help you. Stand up. You right going? Oh, uh, hi. He's one month old today. Um, more like I don't know how old he is actually. Guys, isn't he cute though? He's such a cute little muffin. Mom, you guys sh- vote down below what you think we should name him. Do you think his name should be Bank or do you think his name should be Danger? I think his name will be Danger. I think Bank. I think people like kids more better, so I think they're gonna say. Oh, really? Bank, 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 bank. Me, I'm good. I'm good at this place. Me, I just feel like, right, if we take him to a dog park and if we yell out, danger, danger, people are going to think that there's some, like, something actually going on. What do you think? Wait, I have a different, I have a big thing. Okay. Try to guess what I am. Oh. You are a flamingo. No. Yes. Uh, you are a. You guys help me with this thing. Uh, elephant. Uh. I'll make the oil. A bird. <laughs> what animal makes that noise? A toucan. Dolphin. Oh wow! How did I not know that one? Try to guess this. One. A shark. I was Try to guess this one. Come what? closer, I can't see you. Right here. Are you cleaning the cement, Mr. Ace? 
Look it. Nice. Ballerina. Yeah. What's this? A rock star. You're meditating. Yeah, what's that one? Uh, you're a dancer. Yeah. What is this one? Uh, a pop star. Yes, I caught this. Guys, I'm so good at this game. This I have a new one. It's right. called Hit the Beat, Hit the Sound. All right, hit it. I'm the same. Can you come closer over here? Look at these two over there. One, two. Come right here, right? I can't see you over there. You're so far. Hang out at the club. Girl, girl, girl. Girl, girl. Girl, girl, girl. All right, Ace, what's up with you? We're ignoring your sister. No, don't dance to her song. Don't dance to her song. No, we're not we're not even gonna look at her. Ryder! 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 Ride! Hey, 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 hey! Girlfriend. We're not singing songs about going to the club. It's called club. Oh. Hey, can you sing about the beach today? You went to the beach today. Rye. Ryder. Lord help me y'all. Please help. What's happening, Cleaning Ace? We're at the kids club. At the goat kids club. All right, I can get down with that. Can no, you sing about the, the beach? Kids. Mom, it's called kids club. Oh, can you There's sing? There's a bunch of kids, uh -huh. and for their alcohol, for their alcohol, it's actually alcohol cider. Oh my God! Hey, Duke. What, what's your name? Bank. Bank. What's your name, Random Dog? What's your name, Random Dog? Banky. Bank. Hey, Danger. Hi. Hi, Hi cute guy. Mom, look at this one. It's All right. Dog. This is for what? No, my dog. Okay, come closer. We can't see you over there. But right here's the face. I'm going to walk. Oh, wait. oh, wait. Go for it. Do you, girl? I'm going to, like, right here. Uh, this good. Are you gonna walk up closer? Right here? Uh -huh. Yeah. Yeah. That's Let me hard. see the like. What can? Okay. Dude, you're fine. You're fine. I can see you right there. Like right here, is that good? Yep. We're all watching the performance. Look, me and Bank slash Danger are right here watching. Go for it. Walk up to us. It's Who a knows song what he's about going like through. the whole world. Okay. Wait, I thought you were going to walk up here. I can't hear you. Get along, get along, get along. What's up, YouTube family? It's Zach. I'm back again. This is day two. I wasn't around for a shy when they were out here playing around with the dog. I had to get stuff situated around the house. But just wanted to touch bases a little bit again. Um, first and foremost, Macy, thank you so much. Uh, you guys were very accommodating. Diamond and the Fluff Frenchies, you guys are nothing short of spectacular, amazing. You guys do phenomenal work. And I don't know, we're just so excited for the new dog. We still don't have a name yet. So 
please drop the names in the comments if you have a suggestion or vote on either danger or what was the other one danger or damn it's all right bank all right i'm kind of rotten i can't even tell you i don't want you guys to lean towards what i'm saying so pick your poison whichever one you think is better drop the drop the comment drop a name let us know um but yeah back to diamond in the fluff you guys are outdid yourself you guys came all the way from north dallas y'all don't know how appreciative me and my family are of that it's you know not a lot of people are make that trip they got you know you want something if you want an iphone you gotta go to apple to go pick it up you know they have delivery services but for the most part you get what i'm saying y'all came out your way you guys came all the way out here came to the house we got to hang out we had lunch together you know got to pick each other's brains play with the dogs and just you know vibe out other than that how i met diamond in the fluff and how i met macy i was on instagram live well i wasn't on live but i was watching a live and it happened to be her instagram i don't know how i came across it but it was a late night it was about 10 p.m one night and i just clicked it and i don't know i just vibed with them they were on there they had like a group live thing going they were showing off the dogs and everything and so i don't know if you guys you know go back to our previous youtubes deuce's uh testicles did not they didn't drop deuce was around eight or nine months at the time and i can feel his testicles still like up in his abdomen a little bit so i was i've been concerned you know i was being a google head trying to figure out what the what the deal was and are they gonna drop i woke up that morning took deuce out to go pee it was about 8 a.m and i don't know i just looked and i noticed there were no balls so i'm like hold on let me just turn him over i took pictures and i took a video and i'm like i'm gonna dm her and just ask her just to see what she can what she can tell me and she responded immediately she was like oh hey how you doing let me um let me reach out to my i think i don't know if it was her neurosurgeon or something that she had a vet that dealt with dogs and she sent it to him and immediately the guy responded she screenshotted and sent me the responses and he was like you have to get that dog neutered it can have and it comes with you know pretty severe problems they're stuck in his intestines he said so me right then and there i'm not about to lose my dog so but deuce i promise to you has been happier more playful i don't know if he was in pain from it because dogs mask their pain they don't if they have a, a a leg and they're limping around they just go on about their day they're not about to sit there and whine and cry they'll still play with you and act like nothing's wrong so that could have been what he was doing he might have been in serious pain and we might have never known so i'm happy we got it done and this is all thanks to macy again because i would have you know just been kind of sitting there waiting for them to drop the person that i got them from told me keep waiting and she was like no whoever you got that dog from is you know that's that's messed up that's not how it's supposed to be done so we kind of connected on a little bit and she was just telling me on how she had litters coming up and you know she doesn't have like a kennel how you guys would assume when you get a dog from somebody you guys automatically assume these dogs are caged and they're just treated bad i've saw her 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 home and how she houses the dogs they're all loved like they're family members they all sleep in beds they're all family they're not sitting in a kennel outside you know covered in fleas and dirt no they're not there she has more of a it's a rehoming thing that she does and we got a new dog he's rehomed with us and we're happy um when i got deuce and i posted him i got a lot of people stating you know adopt don't shop adopt don't shop but it's like the thing is with certain people that they don't understand is you guys don't know my background my whole life every animal i've owned was from the shelter all of my dogs were adopted and i'm all for it i'm for adoption i love animals you know if i i see a cat just came on our porch the other day i walked right outside bought some food bought some water to it everybody's like well you know that's gonna be your cat now and he keeps coming around i don't mind it i don't i feel you know i have a a soft spot a weakness for animals i don't know always been that way my whole life but back to what i was saying i've adopted my whole life and there's this french bulldog breed that's just great i fell in love with him one day and i just wanted one so i couldn't find an, a, a french bulldog to adopt so i had to go the other route and buy a dog and i don't see you know that much being wrong with it at all but i do feel for certain people who see the dogs that are going through abuse and that's not cool at all if i could i would go buy all of those dogs myself and home them here but i can't do that i just physically can't it's just too much going on we have two already but trust me i i feel for you guys and i do believe you should adopt don't shop but 
I have done it my whole life and I just French Bulldog that breed is something that's really stuck with me they have their own personalities and they're just great they're good dogs and we got it from Diamond and the Fluff Frenchies and they are a just outstanding phenomenal I don't I can't call them kennel they're just a family that's what I'm gonna call them they're just a great Frenchie family they love their dogs just as they love their kids and everything just as I love my kids and that's where I wanted to get my dog from somebody who who cares and you know I don't know just puts their best foot forward and they did that in every aspect of the way like I said they were super accommodating they came all the way out here from North Dallas it's like come on man I'm t I want to I want to go out there you know when the dog hits like one years old we're gonna have a little reunion a little powwow or something because I like to keep you know they grew up with the dog well they only had him for about nine weeks but still I want to bring the dog over to see his mom why not that's dope my ideal thing was I wanted to have Deuce and then go to female and then have a whole family of dogs but I don't think Shy would ever let that happen it would just be too much sorry we got flies back here because we got two dogs now so they're coming in hot but anyways that is how I found Macy uh yeah just over Instagram the power of the internet and now we have our what is it fourth child in the house and I love it I'm, I'm so happy the dog is beautiful he is a fluffy breed which is totally different they're like the bougie version of the French Bulldogs which they are they're pretty crazy but I, I love it like I don't know I've never seen a fluffy French Bulldog in my life and it feels like a fluffy Yorkie or a lab or something like that the coat is so soft they did such a great job they really know what they're doing they're not just breeding any dog with a random dog like you know you have to look at genetics you have to look at all of that and they take everything into accountability my dog came fully vaxxed everything's done I mean up to date he can't get fully you know all his shots until he's a certain age but he has everything up to date came with insurance AKC registered full package deal and I can't thank them enough um, yeah I but definitely if you guys want a French Bulldog Golden Doodle as well that's what she specializes in she was uh, televised for it as well I'm gonna try to put the link up so you guys can tune in and see it her Golden Doodles I, if I wasn't like a I want a French Bulldog type person definitely will grab one of those two the dogs are beautiful I showed one to Cheyenne she was like oh why can't we get that one but we're just we're gonna stick with Frenchies I don't know it's something about their personalities they're just different from a lot of dogs I don't know that's the way it went that's how we met again very 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 thankful Ryder you, you guys don't understand how happy Ryder is right now she's every time somebody FaceTime shy or call shy she grabs the dog picks him up wait mommy show him show him the no, new dog show him the new dog so to see her happy makes me happy and then on top of that Deuce is happy I feel like when you have a dog and you know you don't have any other dogs around it it's just to me it's I mean it's doable you can do it I've done it before but I also always had multiple dogs so they can entertain and play with each other you don't want to have a dog just sitting around by themselves all day especially if you're working and you're busy um, these breeds have very serious separation anxiety starting with Deuce I'll show you guys what he does to the door when we leave so I'm glad that now we fit in that missing piece of the puzzle and he has a brother now that he can play with and I mean honestly it kind of looks like it looks like his mini me like Ryder said it perfect she said we just all have our mini me Cheyenne has me you have ace and Deuce has no name right now so I was like oh you that's spot on that was a great job so I'm just happy man I'm happy ace is loving him ace I don't think he understands that he's a puppy because ace was trying to ride him like he would hop on deuce but he's getting it the dog is very gentle with ace he's cool he's a nibbler right now because he's teething but we're happy man I don't know what else to say but if you guys are interested Make sure you guys check out Diamond and the Fluff Frenchies. I'm going to tag them on this video. Below their page up. Show them love, man. They showed us love. They watched the show as well. So it was really cool being able to, you know, sit down and actually talk to somebody who, who kind of knew us but didn't know us all the way. So we can, you know, really sit down and actually they can get to know us on a personal level versus over the media or television i enjoyed it i had fun and i really do hope that you know we can all reconnect again later on down the line and who knows maybe we'll get another french bulldog if if i can convince them uh, mm -hmm, to let me do it but you know once we move here we'll be in a new house we'll have more space you know i have a room for the dogs i'm probably gonna put 
I seen on this website they have like a it's a house for dogs it's literally a mini home for dogs it's not too big it's not this crazy price thing it's just you know some wood slapped together with a window and some stairs but it's so dope it's like I just want to it, it looks good it's aesthetically pleasing too so I'm getting a man cave in our new home I think I'm gonna put them in there and just let that be theirs and you know get the dogs transitioned from sleeping in our bed to their own because right now Deuce he sleeps with us I've never had a dog that did not sleep with me I mean it's tough when we started with Deuce Deuce was peeing in the bed everything I've bought so many new sheets I don't know probably like over 10 new pairs of sheets pillows everything uh, it's just bad I put the dog in the bed the first night he did great there was not an accident he peed in the house a little bit probably like two times but that was kind of within the first three hours of him being there and he took a dump on Ryder's um, carpet but it was on a, like a little coloring book piece of paper so this is what was expected if you get a dog you know but he's very good with pee pads you can tell he was already trained on them because as soon as I laid one down he went on it and so now I'm already I already took the ones out of the living room and I leave them by the back door he's getting a hang of it he already went to the back door and peed on it and it's easier because he gets to follow his brother Deuce and gets put on a regiment it's more of a routine he gets to see how he does it so then it's like okay I'm gonna follow him and follow suit done deal but once again diamond in the fluff you guys are two thumbs up if I had 10 thumbs I'd give them all up you guys are great thank you big shout out um, Macy gotta meet your husband I'm mad he couldn't make it down here we're gonna we're gonna get you down here man he's never been to California we're gonna get you down here and show you a great time all right thank you guys make sure to like comment and subscribe on this video tune back in we're gonna be giving you updates a lot more I know we say this every time but I'm picking up the slack I take the blame for it Cheyenne works so hard she's constantly busy and working and I think I forget that you know I can I can do this YouTube thing too so watch this I got this got this y'all thank you